Welcome to Liturgy of the Hours with Deacon Kevin. This is morning prayer. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth will proclaim your praise. Come, let us worship God who brings the world and its wonders from darkness into light. Cry out with joy to the Lord all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before him singing for joy. Know that he, the Lord, is God. He made us. We belong to him. We are his people, the sheep of his flock. Go within his gates giving thanks. Enter his courts with songs of praise. Give thanks to him and bless his name. Indeed, how good is the Lord, eternal his merciful love. He is faithful from age to age. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship God, who brings the world and its wonders from darkness into light. Praise my soul, the King of heaven. To his feet your tribute bring. Ransom healed, restored, forgiven, evermore his praises sing. Alleluia, alleluia, praise the everlasting King. Praise him for his grace and favor to his children in distress. Praise him still the same as ever, slow to chide and swift to bless. Alleluia, alleluia, glorious in his faithfulness. Father-like he tends and spares us well, our feeble frame he knows in his hand he gently bears us rescues us from all our foes alleluia alleluia widely yet his mercy flows angels help us to adore him you behold him face to face sun and moon bow down before him join the praises of our race alleluia alleluia Praise with us the God of grace. Dawn finds me ready to welcome you, my God. I call with all my heart, Lord, hear me. I will keep your statutes. I call upon you, save me, and I will do your will. I rise before dawn and cry for help. I hope in your word. My eyes watch through the night to ponder your promise. In your love, hear my voice, O Lord. Give me life by your decrees. Those who harm me unjustly draw near. They are far from your law. But you, O Lord, are close. Your commands are true. Long have I known that your will is established forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Save us by the power of your hand, Father, for our enemies have ignored your words. May the fire of your word consume our sins and its brightness illumine our hearts. Dawn finds me ready to welcome you, my God. The Lord is my strength, and I shall sing his praise, for he has become my Savior. I will sing to the Lord, for he is gloriously triumphant, horse and chariot he has cast into the sea. My strength and my courage is the Lord, and he has been my Savior. He is my God, I praise him, the God of my Father, I extol him. The Lord is a warrior. Lord is his name. Pharaoh's chariots and army he hurled into the sea. At a breath of your anger the waters piled up, and the flowing waters stood like a mound. The flood waters congealed in the midst of the sea. The enemy boasted, I will pursue and overtake them. I will divide the spoils and have my fill of them. I will draw my sword. My hand shall despoil them. When your wind blew, the sea covered them like lead. They sank in the mighty waters. 
Who is like you among the gods, O Lord? Who is like to you, magnificent in holiness, O terrible in renown, worker of wonders? When you stretched out your right hand, the earth swallowed them. In your mercy you led the people you redeemed. In your strength you guided them to your holy dwelling. And you brought them in and planted them on the mountain of your inheritance, the place where you made a seat, O Lord, the sanctuary, O Lord, which your hands established. The Lord shall reign forever and ever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord is my strength, and I shall sing his praise, for he has become my Savior. O oh, praise the Lord, all you nations! O oh, praise the Lord, all you nations. Acclaim him, all you peoples. Strong is his love for us. He is faithful forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. God our Father, may all nations and peoples praise you. May Jesus, who is called faithful and true, and who lives with you eternally, possess our hearts forever. O oh, praise the Lord, all you nations. A reading from 2 Peter chapter 1. Be solicitous to make your call and election permanent, brothers. Surely those who do so will never be lost. On the contrary, your entry into the everlasting kingdom of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ will be richly provided for. I cry to you, O Lord, for you are my refuge. I cry to you, O Lord, for you are my refuge. You are all I desire in the land of the living, for you are my refuge. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, I cry to you, O Lord, for you are my refuge. Lord, shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, and holy and righteous in his sights all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Lord, shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death. Let us all praise Christ. In order to become our faithful and merciful high priest before the Father's throne, he chose to become one of us, a brother in all things. In prayer we ask him, Lord, share with us the treasure of your love. Son of justice, you filled us with light at our baptism. We dedicate this day to you. At every hour of the day, we give you glory. In all our deeds, we offer you praise. Mary, your mother, was obedient to your word. Direct our lives in accordance with that word. 
Our lives are surrounded with passing things, set our hearts on things of heaven, so that through faith, hope, and charity, we may come to enjoy the vision of your glory. Now let us pray as the Lord has taught us to pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, free us from the dark night of death. Let the light of resurrection dawn within our hearts to bring us to the radiance of eternal life. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace, glorifying the Lord by your life. Thanks be to God.